And this is the Mad Scientist Cocktail and Mocktail Lab. It feels like you're hiding up in somebody's attic, concocting. Jen Lowen is facilitator of this laboratory where mixology is part scientific method, part questionable decision making. This is a playground for adults, so I'm not necessarily teaching proper technique or terminology. You get to take risks here you would never take at home because you don't want to waste or buy your own expensive unknown ingredients. So everyone gets a lab coat when they enter. Just like that, my PhD. Got some safety glasses for your protection. Fake doctors also need pseudonyms. No one goes by their real name here. That's Dr. Terremoto. You know what that means? Earthquake. Jose came to shake things up, and it all starts at the infusion station. And normally an infusion takes two to three weeks to make. Uh, we figured out how to bring it down to 10 minutes. Jose's making a guacamole cocktail using avocado infused tequila. Just because I like avocado, I'm gonna go heavy on this guy. Mmm, yummy. I'm opting for color using pea flour to make purple vodka. Science. There are hundreds of tools to work with. And where there's fire, there's smoke. You can smoke a liquid. You can smoke a cherry. You can smoke an orange peel. Spencer is smoking whiskey with two inspired wood chip choices. I'm going to do maple and apple because it's going to be like a breakfast drink. Cheers. Cheers. Based on this field research, the experiment turned out great. I'm very smoky. Good job. Thanks. <laughs> Meantime, I add some flair to my creation in the form of drinkable glitter, then some lemon because when it blends with a pea flower, a chemical reaction dazzles us. And the same thing would happen with a mocktail. Because you don't need alcohol to have an amazing drink. Most everything is non-alcohol centric. But Dr. Earthquake has other plans for his guacamole cocktail. And just because I like it like that, more tequila. The moment of truth, our taste test. I'm still trying to figure it out what it is. It's bad, Ooh. is what it is. Yeah. It's not good. Not I'm getting good. used to it, though. No? Oh. Did you see the amount of tequila you poured in it? I think that that's just <laughs> having that's why an I'm getting effect. used to it. But even failing is still a win, because Jen says the empirical evidence is clear. Concocting drinks in any form builds connection. Cheers! All right, thank you, Kim. Looks like so much fun. The lab is about $85 per person by appointment only. If you'd like to reserve a spot, go to our website, king5evening.com. Well, it is.